The rest of the actors are coming. They're, they're just stuck in traffic and they'll join us. But, but I actually, I'm, I'm glad of this because I wanted to talk to Luca a little bit before we got the actors here. Um, in privacy. In privacy, that's right. <laughs> um, um, Luca, why the, the environment, the house, Crema is so instrumental. It's like a, another character in this movie. Why the original book is said in 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 the uh, Italian Riviera. Why why did you shift it to Crema? Thank you for the question. Um, it's, it's it's very strange because I, I do love Andres Asiman book very much, and I dearly appreciate it when I read it in the first place many many years ago. Uh, but the moment in which I be became possessed by the idea of making this movie is when I conjured to put together the book and the world of the book with this place where I live, which is Crema, and this house that I have had visited a few years before and kept recurring in my mind. And one day I felt like, oh, maybe this family, the Perlmans, could live there. And when that was, in a way, an epiphany to me, I, it, it is when I m became very motivated to proceed in making this film as my film, as a director, along with the, the idea of working with these amazing people that is going to join us soon, hopefully. And no, well, some of them are here already. Um, the, 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 the light. Uh, it is so pivotal in in the film. Um, we we talked briefly outside that the that the in the the windows, the outside light, the inside and the outside of this world. Um, can you talk to us about how you are able to combine light with character? Um, the the idea for me is always uh, to to try to be in the place and to make sure that the figures are part of the landscape, whether it's a sort of urban landscape or an architectural landscape or a natural landscape. Um, and uh, the, the, the Pianura Padana, where we set this film, which is unlikely any other places in Italy because it's very flat and it's very, in a way, repetitive with this motif of flatlands and high trees and little canals of water. Um, comes to me uh, in my imagination of a, of a place of Id idyllic, idyllic place where, where the light is very kind, very, very gentle, uh, where a, an open window is a way, is a, like a big eye that communicates the interior to the exterior and, the, and vice versa. So I, I think me and my DP, Sayon Bumuk Diprom, we, we thought about that and we tried to re 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 repeat that on the screen to try to give this kind of physical sensation of being there to an audience. 